How do you feel? Tired. You feel tired? <laughs> but I am not. Because okay. this is more like a new thing that I do every single day. But one of the things that I really love doing this in here, the fact that I'm jogging right here at, next to the Atlantic Ocean, but not in Africa, but in the Caribbean. And whilst you're jogging in here, you get a chance to see greens and blues everywhere. I don't know if you guys can see my surroundings. I mean, how many colors do you see? Look at that. Whose babe is that though? That's your babes. Babe, your skin is glowing right here, man. Is there sun here in Barbados? <laughs> is it in Barbados? You get to enjoy vitamin A, B, C, and vitamin Z. Have you heard of that before? Vitamin Z? Yeah. What is vitamin Z? <laughs> you, you don't know vitamin Z? No. Sorry. It, it means that in Barbados, you get the chance to enjoy all the vitamins from A to Z. Ah. <laughs> just, just because the sun that hits in here is so different. It's look at, different. Look at your skin. You know, your, your skin is actually enjoying vitamin K. Oh, okay. You didn't know that, right? Know that. You do your research and find out. I guess what you're trying to say is the sun is sunning. Oh, <laughs> and your skin is glowing. Exactly. That's a, <laughs> but anyway, we've been here for the past 10 days, and every single morning we wake up to this sun. The most beautiful view ever. And, and can you notice that the sun is actually rising on the ocean? Yeah. And it's a blessing to be experiencing this. I feel like we're living somebody's retirement dream. Oh, that's absolutely. Whilst true. we're young. Because we see the people around us are old. Exactly. Old white guys. So like being in this hotel, most of the people that are here are more like old people retired people retired people so it's really a blessing i remember like one retired man came to me and said uh, yeah like are you athletic are you an athlete because your body you look like you're an athlete my was like uh no the guy was like i thought you were an athlete or a celebrity and i was like the first part was wrong but the second part was definitely correct <laughs> just because i jog every morning i'm so proud of you babes you you're my inspiration do you want to join me today definitely I've got to share this with. I've been eating so much sugar, so much food. I've been spoiled in this country, so it's time to get that body back. I actually started this whole trip with six packs, mm -hmm. but I'm ending this trip with a pot belly. Who do you blame? Barbados? The Caribbeans, man. Because <laughs> they have amazing food. The Caribbeans. The food here is amazing. You know, you know, you, know, like, you can't help it. You just want to eat and eat it. Like right now, I wanted to tell you, I'm just thinking of breakfast already. The fact that they have amazing food. Mm they've been feed overfeeding me exactly everywhere i go they're like oh this is food this is that please eat the food is so good you can't ah, say no my goodness and you can't say no and you know me food over everything and i'm like you know what that body can wait you don't miss meat i would never miss meat why would i miss meat because you're used to it no like a vegetable like this it's actually the best when I go to Ghana, I'll fast. But now that I'm here, you gotta enjoy the Caribbean food. Yeah, <laughs> and after jo enjoying the Caribbean food, you enjoy the Caribbean <laughs> music. Oh my the god. The soccer music. Uh, you know, you remember that song? I know, of course. What's yeah. the, uh, can you go with it? Put your hands up and roll up a day. Put your hands up. <laughs> hands in the air and roll it. Hands on your shoulders, roll it. Hands on your waist and roll it. Hands on your. Jeez, look at that. No, this is 18. I'm sorry. You don't have to watch this one. <laughs> but yo, I, I love this place, man. Like, look at that. It's 
see the colors you've seen. Blue, white. Green, blue, white. These are my favorite colors, you know. Welcome to Barbados and enjoy Wadeham Resort. When I saw you, I would lose control. Made me feel like there was no tomorrow. Should have told you that you're beautiful. But the days pass and now it's so long ago. Did you make it? Did you break free? Did you manage to be who you wanna be? Maybe somewhere you think about me too Welcome to our apartment here at Wainham in Barbados. Come with me. This is our living room and it's a very spacious room. Cozy. Minimalist with a touch of luxury as Maya would say. Always. <laughs> I always love things simple. The simpler the better. Babes, you just look like you're enjoying life. I'm living my best life. Wow. Traveling, having fun, educating people, and at the end of the day, yeah, touching a lot of lives. That's amazing. That's the best thing. Anyway, this is my favorite part of the room. <laughs> Why is it your favorite part? The ocean view. I know, right? You know? For me, it's the pool. The pool for me. Ah, how can the <laughs> be pool for you? The ocean. pool is so beautiful. The ocean is a mighty pool, baby. Oh, yeah, you're yeah, right. The mighty pool. This is how we chill. Oh. When you want, you know, the view of the ocean. The view of the what? The oh, it beams. The view of the what? The ocean. I'm falling. Tell, Tell me, me why where I'm falling. falling. I love the design of the room. Have you shown them the mini kitchen? Right here we have the mini kitchen. This is where we make coffee, tea, you know, all those things that you want to eat. This is where we do that. I love the fact that the room was designed with wood. Ah, yeah. And look Very at that. Very creative. So I can decide to enter my bedroom from here by entering the washroom. And this is how the washroom looks like very modern and very everything modern. is for two i know right yes his and hers this is the bedroom and for me what stands out the most apart from the view is the art on the wall very creative i stayed here for the past 10 days and i've never seen this art on the wall how come because i'm not an art person oh yeah but i've stayed here for the past 10 days and I know how soft this bed is. <laughs> because I got a feeling that tonight's gonna be a good night. You got an amazing resort, man. That is correct, that is correct. Listen, mm -hmm. this resort is a piece of art. It is. I feel like they intentionally took their time to design it, put the pool here, make sure the ocean is here. And the fact that mm. the ocean got different shades of blue. That's correct. My goodness. Should I say this is a paradise? <laughs> we are in paradise, that is correct. How do you feel living in a paradise, man? You're waking up every day to this paradise. I can live anywhere else other than paradise. Tell them why they need to stay here. Why they need to stay here? Yeah. Because Wyndham Grand Barbados Sunrise Castle is a unique resort. There's nothing like it in Barbados. And I venture to say in the Eastern Caribbean in the region, it is very unique, not only from 
the materials that was used to build it because we are a very environmentally conscious resort and from the developmental stages um, that was taken into consideration and all of the materials that were used to build this resort were environmentally and responsibly sourced. So that's mm. one of our main factors as well too. I mean apart from the beautiful waters that you mentioned behind you, I don't think I need to explain that. That is one of the reasons why anybody will come to Barbados just to stand and watch that water as it blows. Mm. But outside of that, um, one other reason why you should come to Barbados of course, it's people. A building could be anything in the world, but if the people don't make it what it's supposed to be, then there's nothing. So this is <laughs> hospitality at its best. I, I just want to talk about the location yes, of the resort. Because when I came in here, everyone is like, oh wow, you're living in at St. Phillips? Some... Some large castle. And I'm like, that's not a castle? Is this a castle <laughs> though? Is well, there a castle around here? There is a castle not too far from where we are located right now. Oh, wow. Um, actually, Sam Lawrence Castle. Unfortunately, we lost that to a fire, I think, in 2010. Um, so it's actually a, a piece of history. Um, but I don't know if you know the story of Sam Lawrence. Unless you tell me. <laughs> so the story allegedly is that what he used to do is that he would hang lanterns from the trees to give ships are sailing the impression that they're approaching the port in Bridgetown. And when it comes to shore it butts against the coral the reef sorry and the ship crashes and at that point he will then pillage the ship and steal their loot and what's not so that's wow. part of the history um with sam lodge castle so sam lodge was a thief is that what you're trying to say <laughs> that's not what i'm trying to say that's, that's what the story <laughs> <No>, no. say <laughs> that's what the story <laughs> say okay. uh, but you know it is the castle still remains um well the the, the, sh the shell of it still mm. remains and i believe that that will be a part of history for time to come what makes this resort so unique what makes it so unique yeah i think there are so many things that make it unique and as i would have mentioned before from its environmental sustainability approach um from the materials that were used to build this resort um our conference space the single largest conference space i believe in any hotel in barbados and again within the region mm -hmm. but i think what makes it the most is the people that work here is it affordable to live in here is it affordable to live in barbados is it here? no here 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 yeah, man there, there's there's something here for everyone yeah there's something here for everyone for, from from every type of tourists we have um for family resorts mm. um we also have for the business traveler we also have for the group traveler and we also have from the environmentally conscious traveler so there's something here at Wyndham grand barbados for everyone there's nothing for digital nomads like us <laughs> really because you never mentioned huh Digital nomads, some of us, we, we travel to stay in a place for one month, two months, and we go out. Do you have anything for us? Well, we don't have any long-term um, um, residences, but you're more than welcome to stay here for two months if you want to. <laughs> Only if you can afford. Nah. <laughs> Thank you so much for it was an absolute taking pleasure. me around, man. I appreciate you. Bro. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. I had to come and look for you because I've been staying here for 10 days and the food, breakfast, lunch, dinner, all of them is excellent. Thank you. I'm like, Thank you, you know what? I need to give the chef a credit. Now he makes me comfortable. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's, all, it's all teamwork. The team is doing a great job. We have a very good team, young budding talents and really we are really excited to serve the international cuisine and this is a Mediterranean market mm. so the evening theme is Mediterranean and as you can see we have some action station we have some barista bar some sushi some pizza so we have all kind of things over here right from the oven, man. Hmm. Piping hot. Hmm. 
Let, to... let him enjoy, let him enjoy. <laughs> made my time better the DJ the DJ in this hotel is playing some African music uh, 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 it feels it feels so good hearing Ghana song in Barbados man <laughs> uh, let's go Uh, ha! You can dance. I bless the day I found you. <laughs> oh, Lord, I this is odd. When you show, odd oh, you when you do. You know what is odd you? You know what is it? My love. Oh. Odd. Odd. Odd you. Odd you. Ah, my odoyo. Ah. <laughs> no Let's go. <laughs> Should have told you that you're beautiful, but the days pass and now it's so long ago. Did you make it? Did you break free? Did you manage to be who you wanna be? Maybe somewhere you think about me too. I love how whenever you find yourself in Windham, like almost every guest gets entertained in the morning, in the afternoon, and in the evening. My favorite part is when you're having dinner and you got some live music going on. Right. Uh how did you guys come up with all these things? Too? Because I've, I've slept in countless of hotels across the world, man. So this is kind of new to me. Right. Is it a whole process or something? It is. So guess what? Our aim at all times is to ensure that we exceed guest expectations. Oh, right? wow. Hence the reason for this. So what we did, we selected persons with extraordinary talents, persons who are able to put the guests first to ensure that they're on vacation and it's all about them. They get to experience the culture. And of course, it's amazing Barbados. Why not? So we definitely stick to that script to ensure that we entertain them to the fullest. That's, that's amazing, man. Is this something that you get to do every single day when you're here? Every single day. And it all goes back to passion. We're passionate about what we do. When the guests are happy, we're happy. <laughs> Since we are in the Caribbean, <clears throat> do you guys have a choice of music or something? So guess what? Mm. We're in the Caribbean. It's all about the Caribbean culture. So we have reggae, we have soca, we have calypso. You name it, you can get it right here at the Wyndham Grand Hotel. You know, I was so shocked. There was a day I was having dinner and I heard songs from Ghana. Do you know, touch it, touch it, touch Listen, it. Listen, the Afrobeats for us, once it's music, it's us. It's who we are. I love that. Yeah, it's so I love yeah. that. So if you're from Africa and you want to visit, trust me, you'll feel belong in here because you got the Afro beats right here, the Nigerian music, the Ghana music infused over here. And uh, my brother, what is that one best kept secret that they should expect whenever they come in here? When you come to Barbados, especially Wyndham Grand Barbados, that one best thing you should expect is that you will be entertained, nothing less. Throughout the entire day, it's most likely you will have too much because that's what we do. We give you more than what you expect. 